the most common conditions with which patients come to my clinic is melasma. Melasma is seen in men and women, but somehow it is seen more commonly in women and especially more so above the age of 40 or so. It starts as dark patches on the cheeks, gradually spreading to forehead, nose, chin and occasionally to the neck also. This can be really worrisome for many because it's on the face and it is visible as dark patches. Well, melasma doesn't happen to you because of something which you have done. However, sun exposure increases melasma. So using a sun protection or a good sun block is the first way to prevent the rapid increase of melasma. So SPF 40 is minimum required and apply 20 minutes prior sun exposure and reapply 3 early as I keep on seeing in all my videos between sunrise and sunset whether it is rainy or cloudy or even if you are indoors. Remember the natural lights which come in to your apartment or your office through the glass doors, windows or balconies can also cause pigmentation and hence sunblock is absolutely essential. In addition to using a sunscreen, certain skin lightening agents can also help in decreasing the melasma. I also recommend some procedures, in-clinic procedures like chemical peels to control melasma. However, understand that this requires long-term treatment and of course maintenance too. Vitamin C supplements will also help because it actually prevents the pigmentation pathway or prevents the pigment being formed under the skin. So, vitamin C tablets, some antioxidants, sunscreen, certain depigmenting agents and chemical procedures like peel will definitely help in controlling melasma.